happened to her suddenly she's becoming yellowish i already removed some of her leaves which became yellow and now she started getting sick those uh, brownies and wrinkled leaves on the uh, edge part of her leaves that one so i don't know what's happening is it because of the heat in the house just like my other planter uh, like the monstera one the monstera ones so i don't know what's happening there you go it's like she's burning so uh she's not wet actually see it's becoming yellowish and that one she's getting sick there also behind there that one it's like she's burning so i'm gonna cut the one or i just leave it like that and then uh she's not dry she's not wet it's just soft and just okay very soft the dirt is just very soft so i don't know what's happening to her so i'm gonna keep her in the tub as well and then i'm gonna do an update i will keep following on her every day so i'm gonna keep her inside the tub as well so there you go she's there as well so this is the update of my look like monstera but she's not monstera i can't remember her name i don't know where's her tag name there it's gone she used to have one i don't know where where it's gone oh okay i think uh in in, in the bag where i kept her so now she's been here today is the uh, uh the 12th of january 2022 yeah uh thursday i think today is the 12th gee i can't remember the dates okay well now this is her update since uh we kept her here inside the tub so now the progress is very good we started seeing those teeny tiny babies coming out or protruding here from the roots from her from her feet or from the roots see that one two and so probably this one i gonna cut this one out that's okay and another one here so there are three new babies coming out already I'm not sure if those are babies or leaves. That looks like. Probably leaves. Okay, looks like leaves, not babies. But yeah, that is the progress, the update of this girl here, this lady. So this dive back here i'm gonna keep an eye on her and then i'm gonna put uh, water on her and then let her drain there she has those uh, nice and big drains there so yeah let me water her and i'll just use this one uh, the culture, uh, the sealant of our uh, tub is, it, it's needed to be a change, but I gotta do my plants first, so we'll see, I don't know what's happening to her, but
I'm gonna wet her completely and leave her to drain in the tub just like my other lady here. The Monstera looks like, I can't remember their name, such complicated names. Yeah. So, I'm gonna wet her more. Make sure it's not hot water. Give her a little shower. She is one of the most expensive plants of us. She was too, but then uh, she wasn't uh, looking very well. So they gave her, she was actually $26 too, and then we got her for uh, almost uh, $5 uh, together with the uh, fiddle leaves fag. So yeah, let me see if the water is coming out already. Maybe a little bit more. So both of them gonna stay here. Right. Yeah. Because I need to make a space here. Because when we take shower, that's okay. They're gonna stay there. They don't have to go away when we take shower. We have enough space. So, yeah. I usually collect uh, the rainwater, but it's winter, so it's not water, it's ice. It's an ice. So I'm just gonna water them like this from the tap. I know the tap water is acidic, but. But it's, I mean, I didn't water them because I don't want to ruin them. So, 